It's Spy Film Week and nobody told me. Spy is brilliant. It's got action, it's got thrills, it's got spills, it's got suspense. There's actually moments where you think the protagonist isn't going to make it. This isn't just the normal type of spy spoof where they've thrown together a few innuendos and fart jokes. This is an actual film. With a few tweaks, it could be a proper spy film. And that's brilliant. Let's break it down. Susan Cooper, a desk dweller at the CIA, is forced into the field after its top agent is killed and the rest of its agent's identities are compromised. Forced to track an arms dealer with a nuclear bomb to sell, will she survive and stop global catastrophe? I have not laughed at a film this hard in years. Melissa McCartney is properly funny. Susan Cooper is a brilliant creation. I would love to see her in another film. Jude Law from a previously undiscovered past of America is brilliant in the role, sending up James Bond. Jason Statham sends himself up brilliantly. Yeah, the villain's not up to much and maybe the plot has one twist too many. Director Paul Feig said that this is as close as he's ever going to get to doing an actual James Bond film. And on the basis of this, I think he might actually make a good one. Probably closer to the Roger Moore kind of spy film, but it would be brilliant anyway. The film does go on a little bit too long. I think there's one or two too many plot twists and the film does lean slightly too much towards gross out humour for my personal tastes. But I haven't laughed so hard in years, people in the cinema were laughing all the way through. This is a good film and it's brilliant to see another strong female character coming through this year. It's brilliant. I really, really enjoyed it. It's funny. It's a touch too long. It's a touch too complicated. I think it could have lost about 10 minutes somewhere along the line. Maybe lost... Um, Maybe it could have lost one of the locations. It does seem a bit schizophrenic. Some of the jokes do go on a touch too long, so it's not perfect, but I haven't laughed so hard in a film in years. The cinematography is brilliant, the music fits. I love the way the characters are portrayed. These are three strong female roles in this film. It's brilliant. Miranda Hart is tolerable for once. I went into this film slightly dubious, and I came out utterly convinced that this is a good film. I'm going to give this film my see it rating. I'm Daniel, this is a donkey. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe.